Hi, welcome to my plan with me. Today we are planning for the month of June. This is the first time I've ever filmed a monthly plan with me. Um, but I have so much going on next month that I really need to get this kit down. Um, so I, I'm afraid I'm going to lose my posty notes. So we need to get real stickers down so we can keep planning. So I'm using this Orange Umbrella Co. kit, uh, Triangles, kit 143. I love the rainbow stripes. June is Pride Month, and I think it will just be perfect for that. So uh, we're going to start by putting down the top headers. This is always like the hardest part for me, trying to get them straight. wrong. Completely wrong. There we go. That's better. Okay. I am going to put down all of the dates and I'll speed you through that process because that will take a while, so. My favorite part of the Orange Umbrella Co. monthly kits are that you can choose your own month. So the months come separate. Um, they're very inexpensive. You get a whole year's worth and that way you're not tied down to what monthly kit you want to use. You can use any monthly kit. June is down. All right, I have so many things we have to do. Okay, first let's, we're gonna swap out our PDA stickers. For the pretty ones. And with kit. So they match. have my work shifts down. I'm going to start, have kind of pre-filled out some labels. Um, that first Friday is my stepson's graduation. So I'm going to put a label down like that. Spaz with a graduation cap. Right. Okay, and then we have his open house in the morning. He's doing like a brunch for an open house. That would be his mom's house. And then after that, we are having a surprise party for my mom. Her 70th birthday is on Sunday. And my sister's planning a surprise party, so she has all of her, the rest of our families in Detroit, they're all going to come down um, for the party, and she doesn't know about it. Since her actual birthday is on Sunday, we figured it'd be easier for everybody to come down on Saturday, and that way they can, like, drive home Sunday. So I'm putting that there. It's going to be a busy day. This is her actual birthday. 
I need to stop my cat's meds that day because I'm taking him to Purdue next week for radiation treatment. He's got um, hyperthyroid. And they're going to irradiate his thyroid and then hopefully I can stop having him give him medicine twice a week or twice a day, which is basically driving me crazy. So let me open that also. The sad part is I drop him off, drop him off on that Monday and they do labs on him. They keep him Tuesday. They actually do his radiation treatment on Wednesday and they then they have to like keep him until he's not radioactive anymore. So I don't get him back for like a week. Um, I feel so bad. He's going to be like, I don't think he's going to know what to do. Poor little baby. He's going to think like mommy abandoned him for a week. Okay, I've got honor review on that Wednesday. All right, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use some of this washi. It's more of a TPC weekend. I think it's the 9th through the 13th. Start labeling out in her labs. that since OUC is in sale. Okay. Oh, let's do this pretty and go back down. Okay. Um, here that day, review. My mom has a doctor's appointment that I told her I would take her to. On the 21st. I don't know what time it is, so I left that blank. I can fill that in later. I'm assuming it'll be morning, but I'm off that day, and I said that I would take her. Okay, what else we got going on? Um, that was it for my labels. Put down our payday. Okay. Usually I put down a header at the top for important stuff. Using all the colors of the rainbow this week or this month. Okay. And then I have some deco left over from the spring rainbows kit. And the colors aren't exact, but they're pretty close. And since it's Pride Month, I wanted to use those two rainbows. So maybe we put one down here. And maybe, let's see. What one? All right, and then let's see. I thought these rainbow banners, we'll do one for graduation. Um, let's do the Navy. Actually, let's peel up that Pegasus. Let's put the banner like right on top. That's cute. And then I thought maybe we'd put some balloons down for my mom's birthday, even though we're doing the party. Um, let's see, let's do orange. Orange 
two table. Let's do that. That is my monthly spread for June. Um, we'll add to it as things come up, but at least now I've got my post-it notes are gone, so I don't have to worry about things falling off and getting lost. Um, and the majority of my planning is done for the month. And I'm going to do my monthly highlights in my plum paper planner. And I'm using this triangle uh, monthly kit from Orange Umbrella Co. It is 143. June is Pride Month, so I really like this rainbow stripe. So we picked this kit especially for that. So we're going to put down our circles. I'm bad at actually using these. I do habit track during the week. I'm just bad at remembering to like habit track. I can't decide on one specific thing that I need to track for the month. They're cute. I might go back and fill them in based on one of the things that I track for the week. And the hardest part of the spread is getting the circles down straight. The hardest part for me with any spread is getting my stickers down straight. Fortunately, these remove pretty easily. Okay. All right, and then there are headers. I do the big one first. Um, let's see, Orange Umbrella Co. does sell scripts to fill these. Um, I have my own just because there's some like specific things that I add to mine. But I do use Things to Remember in the middle. And I still do birthdays and events at the top. nice part about these washi strips is they're a little bit wider than what's printed on there which makes it a lot easier to cover up instead of being like exactly the same size okay so we'll do birthdays and events This is so bright. Okay, and then I like important and next month. Next month is like my favorite script because for my monthly because then I can kind of keep track of stuff that I'm not ready to write in. that. Okay, and then what I do is I leave my wide washi down here. And then I track highlights for the week, which kind of helps me pre-plan weekly kits, the things that I'm planning on using, and then books read, which I've been really bad about filling out my May. So I need to go back and do that. Okay. So I'm going to do my 
highlights and pits. And there's really kind of five weeks. In June, that I will plan for. Almost lost four. Five. Okay, and then what we can do is we can use our ruler. strip of pen washi. Take that down. And track our books read for the month. And then what I like to do is use the leftover date covers from the monthly kit as kind of bullet points. And that kind of helps tie everything together. So just put those down. And that is our monthly highlights setup.